We are live at the Great Southern Billiard Tour Championship. This is a bonus match. Two o'clock in the morning, Saturday night. Sunday morning, actually. Little bonus action. Stream's been quiet for over a half an hour. And as a surprise, we're gonna pop in here and throw this match in. The score is now two to two between Rodney Strickland and BJ Ussery. Rodney's gonna fire up on his eight ball break. All right, Frowine is asking who is left in the tournament. Well, that's quite a question there, my friend. I'll have to go give you a bonus look at the something I never do. To go look at the tournament brackets. All right, we have, let's see, Sam Monday versus Chris Turney, and that's Sunday at noon on the winner's side. Ron Park versus Billy Thorpe, Sunday at noon. Kerry Dunn versus Alex Olinger, Sunday at noon. Larry Neville versus Larry Kressel, Sunday at noon. Mike Fuller is playing on the loser side bracket. This is the eight ball I'm talking about here. Maurice Lloyd versus Lucas Hawking. That'll be tomorrow. Rodney Strickland versus BJ Ussery. That's going on now. Possibly these matches are going on right now. Uh, let's see. Mike Concy versus Joey. Yardborough, Mike Conti won that match. So that's about it, my friends. There you go. There's a little end of the night bonus. Hey, I'm going to go walk over here and look at something and do something. There you go. Okay? So glad you joined us here tonight, this morning. Getting ready to head over to the Comfort Suites for some counting of sheep and listening to people snore should be fun but BJ Usry and Rodney Strickland are duking it out here for you two to two definitely want to thank all of our sponsors Kamui cloth or excuse me Kamui tips Millican super pro cloth my bad <laughs> fury dash cues.com love those guys Three to two in favor of BJ Ussery here at the Carolina Open. I believe this is the 17th annual Carolina Open, by the way. This is a side match, a late night action. 
These guys are grinding and out. They've been playing match after match after match. They do not know that they're on the stream, by the way, so we'll see how they play with no knowledge at all that they're on the TV table. Kind of interesting. BJ may know. He looked right at the camera. Want to say hi out there to Jameson New. What's up? Pro pool player, Marty. Marty Herman. New England Hall of Fame pool player. What's up, my friend? Quite a entertaining and interesting individual. I enjoy very much, Marty. Awesome to see you out there, my friend. Let's see, who else do we have out there? Run Out Monster, Slow Roll, Wibbly Islander. What's up, my friend? All the friendlies. We even have a hacker friendly. Hacking our chat. So much fun. We enjoy that. If there's any way that we can help you out, you just let me know. You just send me a little private message. If there's some kind of, you know, miniature bone to pick or whatever the case may be. I'm here to help you, my friend. I am not your enemy. So, let's enjoy this match. Rodney Strickland here up to bat. This guy is dedicated to pool. He loves it. Does commentary with us. and He really, he really schooled me on some stuff, I'll tell you. This guy's got a lot of knowledge. He beat Tony Watson this last match. And of course, he misses the ball as soon as I start talking good about his game. But I, I have seen him run some, some really nice outs. Yeah, he's, he's upset. Something's getting in his head. <laughs> Here's Sydney, champion in the background, making strange noises. Mike Walker, there he is. The man. There he is, right there. See that guy? He is the man. <laughs> yes, we are rocking and rolling here at Fast Eddie's in Goldsboro. Please stop by Fast Eddie's and support Fast Eddie's. You'll hear, you'll, excuse me, you will hear great rock and roll music and be able to play pool on one of 11 nine foot Brunswick Gold Crown threes. They got a great bar, great food, great staff. Treating us real, very well during the tournament. Picked up our hotel room and our food tab. So we want to thank Fast Eddie's for all their sponsorship. We're going to try to get Sam Monday to talk.
All right, Sam promises tomorrow he'll talk on the stream about his match with Tony Watson where he completely obliterated him. What's that? Sam's going to talk tomorrow on the stream. He's going to do a little commentary. Yeah, he really... I mean, that's pretty much intimidating having a triple-A player and you got to step up to bat with him. And then you just play really, really nice pool under pressure, especially Tony, man. He was firing at him and getting into it, but we'll talk about that. Right now we're watching B.J. Ussery versus Rodney Strickland in the bonus late-night action. They're asking how bad he beat Tony. What was the score of that match? Do you remember? Hey, Marge. What was the score of Tony Watson versus Sam Monday? Is there any way to tell that? 11 to 7 was what he beat him. Thank you. Definitely go to greatsouthernbilliardtour.com right now check it out my friend shizzle dizzle SD running great southern billiard tour yeah Larry Neville had to put the smack down on Shannon today about his, he had to beat him because Shannon beat him last year in nine ball. And uh, Larry really came through and, and beat Shannon, I believe 13 to four. Beat him bad, but uh, it's been some upsets here at this uh, championship match. All right, so it looks like BJ's up four to two now. My friends out there. Definitely uh, check out Milliken Super Pro Cloth in your pool rooms and your home. Great cloth. Plays real precise position play, I noticed. We did the Seminole Pro Tour stream from the California Billiard Club. This year, JR and I did. And inside pool. And... Uh, Played very precise, great cloth. Paul is dead. <laughs> he really is dead. <laughs> I have to let you know he's dead. almost necessary to make Paul's dead jokes when the Beatles songs come on. Paul is dead. He's in the ground. Alright, BJ's putting the smack down here. keep wanting to switch the camera but we only have one camera
Everybody's working away here at Fast Eddie's. All the staff running around like army ants. Worker bees, 2 o'clock in the morning. We're up. You're asleep. You are fast asleep, all cuddled up in your bed. Just a dreaming away. And here we are. BJ Usry, 5 to 2, my friendly. The late night bonus action. Everybody else went to sleep, but you hardcore streamers, you stuck around and look what you get. Get a full match bonus that nobody's going to know about except you and me and JR and Milliken Super Pro Cloth and Kamui Tips. They're going to know too. So will Q site and Fury Q's.com. BJ is going to know. Look at that. Nice squat at his rock. Is he going to get a ball? Did Rodney move? BJ got a ball. Emergency exit only is directly above Rodney. <laughs> Whoever loses this match. <laughs> I... <laughs> I highly suspect they will be smashing their head into the door, exiting in an emergency fashion from the tournament arena, my friend. <laughs> oh, I make myself laugh. At myself. And I'm laughing at you, my friend. If you don't go to InsidePoolMag.com and check out our two-year subscription for $27.99 and you get a free Kamui tip voucher. All right, I got to throw that in there. Because I don't do this for free, my friend. <laughs> I do it for chuckles. That's an actual candy, by the way. I want the Angry Birds candy. Did you see that? There's Angry Birds gummy bears. Man, I love that game. I had to get rid of a phone because Angry Birds was on it, and I was getting, like, normally time that I would spend in quiet time, I was playing Angry Birds. It wasn't healthy. I had to get rid of it. <laughs> Jerry Mayan loves Angry Birds from Seminole Pro Tour. He loves Angry Birds. There's a video on YouTube where it's like Angry Birds in real life with these soccer kids. Man, these guys are kicking like 200 yards hitting these bird heads on top of like a mailbox or something. They're kicking soccer balls all the way across. It's pretty cool. Check it out. Unless you're lame. All right, BJ's up. He's going to put Rodney to sleep here pretty quick. Five to two. Six to two. Man, I'm slipping. Yeah, it's six to two now. Here at 2.24 a.m. Sunday morning. Everybody else has their church clothes all laid out, ironed up, pressed up, shoes all ready. Here I am at Fast Eddie. See that guy drinking a beer? He's going straight to hell. <laughs> I am going straight there, my friend, for being out this late. Hey, when was daylight savings time? Daylight savings time. That's, oh, did we change it up? Nice. <laughs> That's actually Lucas Hawkins, and I and he's not going out. See him looking at the camera. He heard me talking about him. He's not. You're not going, Lucas. I am, my friend. I am. I did it to myself. Don't laugh at me. Oh, there's the lovely Heather. I love redhead girls. All right, Rodney breaks. Doesn't look like anything drops. BJ's up to bat. He's on the hill. Come on, man. Step out of the way. 
What are you doing here, man? Lucas, you make a better door than a window, okay, buddy? All right. I got to let these guys know they're on the... All right, Lucas, have a, have a little sip of suds there. Thank God. All right. We'll get to see uh, BJ, who looks like he came out of a video game, Ushery, versus Rodney Strickland, an incredible, talented player. Who may be going flying right out that back door. I mean, he may not even be able to get out of his seat. The door may open. He's just sucked right out. Or BJ could be standing close to the door. I'm going to open it and have Chris Volmar go out the back door, I think. So I hope you guys enjoyed this match. Looks like uh, Billy Jr. Ussery, my friends, is going to run out here. Oh, he shook his head no. He's uh, getting distracted. All right, we got these guys settled down. Shannon put the smack down on them. about that I should have known <laughs> all right it's the end of that match thanks everybody for joining us today this evening this morning wherever you are yeah wherever you are get home get on one of those vans that has like 30 seats and they take you home for free All right, you were on the live stream, man. Oh, yeah. Played good. All right, thanks, everybody, for being out there, and we'll see you tomorrow morning, okay? Nice head.